hey everyone welcome back to my youtube channel today i'm super excited to share with you my experience participating in the front-end web and mobile hackathon i want to start off by saying that this was my very first hackathon and i honestly had no idea what to expect as you may know i recently joined the aws community builder program and this hackathon was a part of that community event so this video is a part of front-end web and mobile community hackathon and in this video we're going to deploy the react app by using the aws amplify service so the challenge was to create a side project using either aws amplify or app sync so i decided to create a react based app called the Cybersecurity policy viewer which lets user view cybersecurity policies and guidelines from different sources all in one place and to make things even more interesting, I used AWS Amplify to handle the backend functionalities. So before dive into our project, let's see what is AWS Amplify. So according to AWS, AWS Amplify is a complete solution that lets front-end web and mobile developers easily build, ship, and host full-stack application on AWS with the flexibility to leverage the breadth of AWS services as use cases evolve. So for this service, uh, no cloud expertise needed. The main objective of AWS Amplify is to simplify the process of building cloud-powered mobile and web applications by providing uh, pre-built components and easy-to-use APIs. With AWS Amplify, uh, developers can focus more on building their applications features instead of worrying about the underlying infrastructure. So for deployment, we need two things. First one is GitHub account. And the second one is AWS account, obviously. So let me quickly show you what I have created. Okay, let me start npm start. It's a complete React based project. Okay, so this is our project like cybersecurity policy documents. As a new employee, it is critical that you comply uh, with our organization security policies to help protect our sensitive data and system. So you have to select a policy. Let me select one that is password security policy. And this will be our password security policy. I have created maybe nine policies or 10 policy. Acceptable use policy, data classification policy. So this will be our data classification policy. Physical security policy. network security policy mobile device policy data backup and recovery policy and remote access policy is also there and the last policy is our incident response policy this one i know it's a very simple and very basic app but as a beginner you can add this in your resume to be honest uh, this was my very first app i had only been learning react and aws amplify for the past 20 days so now let's see the process how we can deploy our app to aws amplify so let me go to the github first of all we'll create a repository okay this is aws amplify okay aws amplify will be the repository name and description will be front-end web and mobile hackathon by aws community builder program okay let me create the repository okay so we have created this repository you guys can follow these commands or you can follow along with me so let's write git init for initializing the git okay empty git repository okay after that git add dot so it will add all the files in our repository let's hit enter okay now let's add git commit hyphen m is for message first commit okay let's write git status on branch master nothing to comment okay now let's go to the github and copy this git remote add origin aws amplify dot git so let me paste it here hit enter okay 
now we can use get push hyphen hyphen u origin master now let's go back click on aws amplifier and you guys can see all of our folders are here src source folder is here app.js is here great so we have pushed our code to this aws amplifier repository now let's go to aws management console and write amplifier click on aws amplifier okay fastest easiest way to develop mobile and web app that scales so let's get started and i'm going to use the amplify hosting so let's click on that get started click on github continue aws amplify would like to permission okay yes authorized install and authorize on your personal account all repositories or only select repositories so let's click on only select repository select repositories and we have created this aws amplify click on that install and authorized recently updated repositories click on that and this is our aws amplify repository here branches master great let's click on next and app name will be cyber security policy viewer and this is a build and test settings uh, edited so the command npm okay it will install the uh, dependencies by the way npm run build and base directory it's output directory and build like it will find the build directory output directory and i am fine with the code let's let me save it okay let's click on next application root framework react using default image okay save and deploy it will take maybe three to four minutes okay so it's in a provision state let's click on it and you will see it will provisioning the docker image by the way yeah the docker image on your host it's a three-step process first one is provision second one is build and third one is deploy so let's wait it's provision let's click on build it's cloning the repositories now it has deployed as you guys can see this will be our domain click on that and here is our app aws amplify is very easy to use only three steps provision build and deploy let me check all the functionality by the way password security policy acceptable use policy data classification physical okay the layout is same data backup remote access incident response okay great it's working so i have hosted my first app by using aws amplify i'm super duper happy to be honest it took a lot of long hours coding and testing the app but i have to say it was an incredible experience i learned so much about react and aw simplify and i'd like to take a moment to thank my mentor anubhav rao and all the members of the aws team i learned so much from them uh, throughout this hackathon and i'm really looking forward to participating in more events like this in the future so if you like my app please give this video a like and subscribe to our channel. Consider using AWS Amplify to host your own app. And I'll be creating a detailed video on this service in the near future. So that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. In the meantime, take care and keep learning. Bye-bye.